All right, welcome back. If you just tuned in, you're watching Daybreak Extra on Trust TV. And, uh, you know, uh, right now we will move into entertainment and try to find out from our entertainment reporter what is happening and what is trending in Nigeria, entertainment-wise, by the way. So uh, we have uh, Rosemary at Embassy right here in the studio with us, as usual. Good morning, and thank you so much for joining us. Good morning, Dasha. Mm. Morning, Ibrahim. Ibrahim. Did you miss me? <laughs> I didn't miss you at, at all. I'm, I didn't miss you Because I'm all. back for you today. Yes, that's <laughs> what. That's what you said. I wasn't looking forward to seeing you. Today. I was not. All right. So tell us what is trending. Um, you know, as usual, there's always someone saying something. Not a violence. Something happening, mm. of course. Um, on my way here, I was on my Twitter and I realized yesterday, the video. You know, the video burner. If you cop few artists they released a couple of music yesterday and initially the video's song came out as number one on the apple music chart mm. and you know he posted he very happy about it and then this morning i opened my twitter and i see burner boy is now number one and he posts the same chart and he puts like a laughing smiley <laughs> <laughs> on top of it Such so violence. yeah so everyone is concerned like you know you've You've given yourself that position, mm. African a giant. giant. No one is struggling with you. So why the continuous, um, what, what would I call it, shade? Mm. Like, if your song is now number one, no problem. We're all happy for you. Mm -hmm. These things, they change all the time. Like, you know, it has to do with how much people are streaming your song, mm. how many plays it's getting and things like that. So, of course... David's song could be number one yesterday, and it was by, number one. Exactly, yesterday. it was number one, and by today, it's mm -hmm. Burner Boy. So you know, accept your win, but you know, having to put mm -hmm. the whole laughing, smiley. He shouldn't was, be happy that he's number one. No, it's not about being happy. Why did he have every everyone that saw that tweet just knew that it was a direct shade. Just like uh, the uh, LOL. David Thank you. David Do was number one. Yeah. He posted it that he was happy that he was number one. Yeah, but then nobody had a problem with it. No, if I all of I a sudden, know you're a Bonner boy, Bonner fan, boy does it, down. and then that means he's no, not. No, he didn't seem happy. He didn't just do it. He put emoji. a laughing smiley. If you're happy, what will you not mean? laugh you when you smile? Mm -mm, that's not the smile. That, that smile is literally hello. You're laughing out loud, like <laughs> you're number happy. one yesterday. Now I'm number now one. I'm number that, one. That, exactly. That was the, Indirect statements that that tweet but, but came. I, that I, I know, no, no, I know, no, no, David no, guys... and Whiskey, you know, are always the ones, you know, who have beef and all that. No, David and Bernard Boy have always. I mean, there was a time they had a fight in Ghana. Oh, they've wow. they've been going at themselves for like a very long time. But personally, I believe these are two people that are big in their own space. Mm. There's no need for a clash. But that's the thing, but, you know, it, it, beef is good for the industry. Yes, it is. is but I'm beef saying that. They are just, they are, there's a certain way you do things, it looks petty. What Bonner Boy did looked petty. Do you okay, want so them to start shooting if, each other okay, before so, you, so, before, so, before, uh, before uh, the people is, is correct? Rosemary, exactly. Now if, you know, now that Bonner Boy is, you know, topping the chart, what if by tomorrow, David Doe goes back to be number one, or even whisk it, and then exactly. Uh, right. And, 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 and then at that time, he can do the LOL or put yeah, a smiley emoji. If he emojis. does the LOL, yeah. what, the, what what would you mean of that? What would you? Take he's out happy of that? that he's number one. Simple. Mm. No, that Ibrahim, mm. don't you look at things with two different meanings, or you just try to it's not black deceive and yourself he is and happy pick one. That he's number. When Davido put it, who was he shading when he put? It? He said he was number he one. He didn't shade anybody. He just said like I'm thankful. But then Bonaboy posted the next I'm day happy. number one. He didn't write I'm happy. He put a Smiley emoji. He did not put smiley, he put a laughing emoji. Which means he was extremely happy. <laughs> Are you being extremely serious? Extremely happy. Ibrahim, <laughs> I'm <laughs> coming for you. Happy. You decided to pick Valentine's Another story. I'm ready for you. In Brenner Boy's voice, another story. Mm -hmm. Well, mm. once more, polygamy has rocked mm. our industry <laughs> again. Mm. Hope it's not messy, Igbe. It's how Agbeke Diona, <laughs> she has, you know, um, over the week, the first wife, you know, came out to say that she doesn't want Mercy taking pictures and videos in the house that, you know, she put in her hard work and her mm. effort and things like that. And the husband came out to say, oh, you built the house, I built the house, you added furniture, which I even returned but, some mm. of the money back to you. Mm. And Mercy has also added some furniture into the house. So I don't really see why it's supposed to be like a big 
argument. But my concern in this whole thing is how all of a sudden this wife that has been in the U.S. AWOL. decided to come back now and fight for a marriage, which the man has already boldly said, you know, wasn't working oh, out Well, well according him. to what I heard, she moved to the U.S., and, uh, you know, she was there. So the man, you know, she left the husband. And then the man kept telling her to come back. You know, she has a marriage in Nigeria yeah. and everything. And she refused, refused to come saying back. she wants to leave in the U.S. So that's and then he got over it and, you know, found, found another love. wife, married. Yeah. So married basically, no, they're not together. They're not together. No. Well, you know, how, you know that thing they say that somebody is dating you, but you're not dating the person. Mm -hmm. So she's marrying him. <laughs> he's not marrying well, her. There was no divorce. Mm -hmm. There was no divorce. There was no divorce per mm -hmm. se, but you know, it's not as if the marriage is that strong. So they're like separate. So they're like separate. There's no but legal he, binding. But he, has, but he has not divorced her. No. Which means legally she's still his wife. Mm. Yeah, but then he does not, um, what's the word? Portray her to be his. So why don't why don't she just or why does why doesn't he just divorce her? But if he does, do you think she would actually she would she actually she would not sign you, or sign it's that kind papers? of woman that left everything she has. I mean, like it doesn't US matter whether she, she signs back. it or not. Once the papers are out there, mm, when she when he draws up the things, I mean, like there's a process to all of these. Yeah, things. Yeah, but she has to sign. Exactly, no, if she, she has doesn't. To sign, but there's a process. Yeah, but if she doesn't sign, and at he the hasn't end of, started the process, which yeah, means I'm saying which means how do we know he hasn't? Which means the young man is still interested. How do we know he hasn't get, started? What do you mean you don't get? Is it possible that he what actually, you, get? you know, sent her papers and she refused? Just, that's what I'm saying. We would have heard something. Because How? You know, we would have heard something. Just like seen you're this hearing, this hearing coming. all these things. Because she should have seen this coming. She should have understood that this is a man and he will not wait for exactly. her forever. I can't do you so have a husband. Right, so now, so even small, long distance so, so now you guys, people cannot you guys, You guys are now seriously siding with the guy. After it's, last week, you guys gender, berated you and Dochi. After you guys, after you guys berated you and Dochi, you guys, we're not against you know a woman performing their duties as well. Yes. She reneged on her duties. That's okay. Okay. You get what I'm saying. And then he moved on, on. after I've, only so God knows how long. How, how different is it? He took another wife. He took another how wife. He didn't get her pregnant. When you and Dochi did. Uh, you, you are Edoche now had, his wife no, with his son. Yeah, wait, mm -hmm. You, Edoche, had a wife and children here in Nigeria. Yeah, that he lives he together. Has, you know, proclaimed. Do you know, the, di do you know the dynamics of their relationship? Happily, what dynamics? Do you know the dynamics? Do you know the dynamics? She said, and got then, someone and, pregnant. And he did, exactly. And, 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 he, and he did the responsible thing and made a, irresponsible. He was irresponsible. Instead of very him to leave her and add her to the list of baby mamas that we already have, he decided to make an honest woman. Can you see? He said honest woman and yet he calls her baby mama. I said, instead of him to leave her to be the baby mama, he made an honest but woman out of her. But she's still a baby mama. But she's but married she's, just she's, because she has a child, not exactly. because she loves her. Do you know how miserable she is? Did he tell you that he doesn't love her? He doesn't. Did he, he tell you He this? doesn't love her. Why are you guys forming opinions now? It's not about forming opinions. Of course it's forming means, opinions. We know this this, thing, this guy didn't know. come out and if say, I don't really, love this woman. If, Brian, if he loved the woman, he would have said, I'm divorcing my wife. That's love. No. If he loves her, it doesn't mean he doesn't love his wife. <laughs> is that so, how you want? Yes. Say it's possible to love two women at a time. Why shouldn't it, why shouldn't it be possible? Why shouldn't it be possible for him to love two women at the same time? <laughs> what are you suspecting? Yeah, suspecting? What are you suspecting? I just yeah, want you guys suspecting. to be fair. You said this guy, Mercy's husband, is the is the chairman. He's doing the right thing, and Yule is not doing the right thing. We didn't say he was doing the right thing. You understand? We are blaming the woman. We are blaming the woman for not doing the right thing. You're not blaming the husband. And now she's all over Mercy. You guys need to. You guys need to find out. Ibrahim, let's let's be honest. See, why did you make that much noise before? Exactly. You're married. Your wife decides to travel UK, UK, US, and she's there. You ask her, come home. Come home, You've not come seen home. her in You've not seen years. her in, in God knows how long. Exactly. And then you move on to marry. You don't move on. The energy she's using to fight wife. now, why did she use it you to fight for her marriage? That's, that's the point this why I'm making. This man just took a second wife. He didn't say, I don't love my wife. That she should go because if she if he wanted that he would have divorced her. He did not. She's still there. He still wants her no, back. Ibrahim, so, Ibrahim, 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 remove yourself from a situation for so long mm -hmm. and then all of a sudden when you feel back. like there's trouble you don't yeah, it, she it doesn't back. work like that she wants to come back it doesn't work like that and he that. loves her and he loves his wife 
<laughs> Obviously, because <laughs> if he didn't love her, he wouldn't divorce her. Let's not argue about that. He would have divorced her. Sorry, I, I have no time for you. Move on, really? I thought you. I'm going to face. I thought you came. I thought you came for me. I thought you came for me this week. Because I thought this week you were coming for me. Back to you, Edo Chip, because he's even the next person I'm going to <laughs> yes, bring up. You, a man guy. that, you know, was so buoyant, yes. flaunting his second wife. Why are you now trying to portray that your first marriage is okay of by course. posting old videos of you and your wife when you were happy? If you are happy with the choices you've made, marrying a second wife, bring her into the house. If your first marriage has scattered, she will move on. Is he portraying the marriage as okay? Yeah, because he, he put or, up or, a or video. No, he put up a video of two of them and for like a minute, everybody was like, oh, Oh, and look at them. Happy. Oh, and she's, she's happy. happy yeah, she's back. She's like, they're back together. Oh, things are, you know, smooth sailing for all of them. All of a sudden, the woman came out to say, please, that video is old. Like, it's not a new video. So my point is, why are you now trying to make people feel like, okay, your family is now on your side? When we all know, like, point blank, your yeah, wife not. was never happy about the decision. Definitely his wife will not be happy about the decision. And nobody yeah, expects her to be saying, happy. Yeah, but I'm saying, so why isn't he a man? Stand on your ground. Why well, well, post videos with your second wife? Let's know if, that he But he has happy. posted pictures about his second wife. He has Did he posted, post he has not. He has posted pictures. No, he, he has not. It's his son. Exactly. It's his son, the wife. Which is the same. 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 Which is his son his wife? Is, is that the person he married? Is, is the same thing. Is that the person he married? He's happy with his Avoid two wives. <laughs> okay, so that brings us to the question of why these celebrities always feel the need to, you know, uh, air their dirty linen in public. In, I, I in don't media. understand it because, you know, the funny thing is, if you look at our foreign celebrities, any marital problems they have that come up online are maybe the ones they want you to know or the ones that just leak. But then there are just some intimate details you would never, ever hear about. But right now, what we have in Nigeria, everybody just, you know, has data, has Instagram, is able to go up on Instagram Live and start airing out their problems. And then you begin to wonder why your marriage is not, you know, solid. You're allowing people who have no idea of your background, how you and this person have worked hard to be together to, you know, put in their opinions. And that's just the thing about life. Once you start to hear this, hear this, hear that, it's very hard for you as a person to make mm. a decision. You're, in fact, any decision you make is not even your own at that point. It has been totally, it has been influenced mm. by others. I mean, just look at the Nikeshi Blessing and her husband situation. With everything that is happening now, even if those people claim that, oh, at one time in their life, they loved themselves, they got married, you know, and all that. With everything that social but media has say said. love? The way they come out to attack each other. But, then what, but these are people that were married. You, exactly, at one point in time. At one point in time, they had, no, people got, it might not be love. For different it reasons. might not be love, but Dash and I feel like for you to live with somebody, to be with someone for a period of time, you must have at least mutual feelings. That one is a standard facts. But then when you now come out and you start saying, you know, bad things about the person, how the person was this and the person is this and the person is that. But you were with that person ever since. Mm. You saw all those things and, and then you stayed. it's now that you're coming but now, out. It's now you're not coming to disturb us <laughs> that the person is doing this, the person is doing that. Honestly we do not in as much as we Nigerians we like just to forget it. There are just some things you shouldn't but, you know, come out to see about sometimes somebody. Sometimes when you've these been with. things happen you know, uh, it's possible that they still love each other so very much, but they do not know how to handle but being that's separate I, I don't think, or separated yeah, or but being I, away from each other. Yes, but I don't think you, you do or you say hurtful things about somebody you claim to love. To be very honest, if I was in Kechi Blessing, after all the man has said currently, even if that man comes with his whole family, they come to beg me, with bags of money, my reputation, whether it's true or not, has been diminished a little. You can't give that back to me. So what's the point? 
you claim you love me, but you're willing to say things about me in public. And then it's different when you know social media is worse. It's different if me, you, and Ibrahim have a conversation. You can say, oh, it's between the three of us. But on social media, you're speaking to a thousand millions. of people, millions of people. And it actually stays there. Yeah. Like, for years and years, a person can years actually years go and back years. and, and, and uh, do those tweets. And, and it's just those. funny how there are some small, small people on all these social media. They only need to take screenshots because they are exactly. keeping, and keep they are keeping it for you. The day mm. you come out to say the opposite, they are like, Apple, is this not you? What you said. But I think with celebrities, I mean, like all these things, I think yeah. they are heat now. They, they want to remain relevant. They want to remain in the, in the, in the eye of the public. And you see, that's my question. When people try to stay relevant, what's the point of, I mean, for some people, no celebrities, it's good news, bad news. It's yeah. all publicity. No publicity is them. bad publicity. But yeah. then at the end of the day, I feel like, Reputation is very important. Yeah, it's all about heat, but what you ask is, is it worth it? Is the heat yes, worth it? Yes, like, is it others? worth it at the end of the day your when future? you're... Thank because you. Because they're thinking about like, the present. If you want now. to be relevant, be relevant for something good, not something that, hey, 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 that's the way they will start your gist. <laughs> yeah, but, but, but it's, 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 it's juicier when it happens like that. Now, when there's controversy, for you, people like talking about controversy. For you, that's on the outside, not for the person on the inside. I mean, people always like to act like, oh, I'm strong, I can take it. But we're all human beings. That's why people have mental breakdowns mm. at the end of the day. Mm. It, it's just the truth. Some things about you should stay hidden. Talking about mental breakdown. Oh, Jennifer, yes. yeah, I was coming to I her. Know, I, know. I mean, there, has, there hasn't been any official statement from her team whatsoever, but... So, but why I, did she I have to delete all... Why, why did the team, let me not even say that, you know, uh, uh, Rumors actually started going around when uh, she she didn't show up for Rita Dominic's wedding. You know, no, I didn't... think it was even before there that. Was... She oh. there was a statement where she put out. She said, um, "Mental illness is not physical; mm -hmm. it's more spiritual." So yeah. if you yeah. if you ever feel like you're going through depression or that but story, people started asking questions when they didn't see, see her that. for Rita Dominic's You know, where is Genevieve? You so know, she actually talked friend. about the mental illness. Yeah, she, she put that on. Was, she put that. No, not about her. She just put yeah, like well, she was it and she said it was spiritual. <laughs> so now it's safe to assume that it could be her village people. <laughs> yeah, but no one has come out to say that she. It's a rumor that she's mentally. But you know, yeah. You but know, then there was not a video that, of her that, of her like painting. Like an old video. I don't. Even, uh, is it, it looks old? like an old video. But then people who know Genevieve know that you know uh, you come out and say something about her. She doesn't just immediately reacts to it. Genevieve is know? one of... Ge Ge Do you get... Genevieve well, is people like... People started talking about her being, you know, mentally ill and uh, held up at a mental institution. She posted that video to her deny... Her team posted the video. It's too. still her. Her To team. deny the rumors. Did she, like, make a statement? No, Nothing. she hasn't. Just posted it. It was just a video of her painting somewhere oh. off... Oh, really? Yeah. No, so they she paint, they're so also painting mental institutions, don't they? Like it's a way to, you know, um, to cope with, uh, to yeah, cope yeah, with the illness. Yes. Yeah, yeah, but personally, I, I, I've always Genevieve. Is, I always tell people that Genevieve is the. I see her like the whiskey of Nollywood. Not like Nollywood. she's the one that she doesn't talk. You can't say bad things about Genevieve exactly. from today mm. till the end of this year. She would never come out to say. Him. That's and why that video an, and she's an amazing actor. Yes, yeah, yeah, that's why that video. Actually, that video is, you know, made is very believe. suspicious because yes, exactly. I, I don't believe Genevieve is the mental institution. You don't believe she is. I don't, you believe. don't believe so. So where did the rumors come from? Okay, but why did she have to delete her pictures? Even if you're people, there, why not leave it? People do that on Insta. It's not. It's yeah, not they do that new. And they start all over. Yeah, so, like it's. It's. I don't see why so people you don't want believe, to. You leave. don't believe the rumors. You believe she's fine. Yeah, I believe you she's fine. You don't believe the rumors as well. You think she's okay? Oh, I don't think she's okay. Well, you think she's I crazy. mean, because no, because I somebody even um, was it called? Somebody men, um, mentioned Uche Jumbo, and they're like, "Have you guys all like gone to check in on Genevieve?" And she was like, "That's the people's problem for believing everything you read and see on social media." So that makes you believe that she's fine. I don't think Genevieve would would be sick. That you know, that sick. No, but the thing is, they just said she's going through a mental people. thing now. They just said she's going through. She could be. But you know, she the could funny just thing is, according, Who said? Not, according like, to according to some, 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 some sources, some anonymous know, sources. Yeah, anonymous yes. sources that you know, there's a lot of uh, drugs involved over the years and all that. So it might be, you know, one of the reasons. So she's and saying pressure. they're saying she's like bonkers. Uh, I don't think not, so. Not, not, she's not, too not, 
totally irredeemable. Yeah. Really? Well, you don't believe that? I don't. Okay. Do yeah. you believe? Like I've always felt like... I haven't heard the rumors. Like, I'm just hearing the rumors from you guys <laughs> right now. I've always felt like Jennifer is well, like the actually woman of steel. Like let's, it, that's the way I've let's, seen her. Let's give it time, right? Let's give yeah, it let's, time. let's give it time. Yeah, well, we do hope. We, we, we pray she's okay. Yes, yes, I she do is hope she's okay. Really because she is an amazing actor. Mm -hmm. Really, a really she amazing she is, like, But she hasn't acted in a really long time. Yeah, but still... And the last thing she did was and that Naomi Lion Campbell, Heart. her bestie, her new bestie, hasn't said anything. Like, that's what I'm saying. Like, like there are people that love Genevieve. If Genevieve was... Truly, they would, truly they would, ill. They would, you would hear they would like the, her. the gist no. would not be this They would subtle. protect her. They would, they would protect her, protect but that's her. not saying the gist would not to be this subtle. Your privacy exactly, you're protecting this particular her. Point they would time. protect her if it were, God forbid. But if it were you, I would do everything it takes to protect you as well. Yeah, but at the end of the day, you're not your <laughs> friend. As, I would protect you. So, as, yeah. <laughs> I see, I can't put my life in two of you. I'll protect you. <laughs> uh, come on, Rosemary. No, no, no. We're no, like, no. We're like we're, we're practically one step no. away from being besties. Oh you and I, we're one step away from being besties. Mm -hmm. Make it two. <laughs> we're two steps away from being besties. But just imagine what happened to Adesua. She was pregnant. Who knew? Did you know she was pregnant? Who but there were rumors a lot of now. people did not know. That's, this is just like That's there are rumors, rumors about Genevieve now. Exactly. So, yeah, I, 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 just, I don't want to be Genevieve is sick. All right, well, whatever the case is, we'll know and find out with time, okay? Mm -hmm. All right, thank you so much, Rosemary Bassi, for joining us uh, with Trending Issues on Daybreak Extra today. Yeah. Until next week. Hopefully, if I come, Ibrahim is... In fact, I'm just hoping that you do something again this week because he said he's ready to share his side of the story. <laughs> he's going to add another wife. He's going to add another he shares wife. the side of the story, yeah. I'm he's adding for another wife. Yeah. He's All sticking right. on number three All now. Right. So we'll be back after the break. Stick around. <laughs>